Etymology and Historical Origin of the Baby Name Heather Heather is an English vocabulary word defining the flowering plant indigenous to the moorlands of Europe, particularly Scotland. The word is ultimately derived from the Middle English hather but later altered to heather in modern English to associate the plant with heath, meaning moor, because that's where the heather plant grew most abundantly. Because the Scottish rocky moors are virtually blanketed with beautiful heather, the plant has become a national symbol to the Scots. The flowering shrub is generally purple or pinkish in hue, less common is the wild white heather. The purple and pink heather have come to symbolize notions of admiration and solitude, while the rarer white heather brings protection, good luck and the fulfillment of wishes. Since the heather plant has always been abundantly available in Scotland, a perennial flower that blooms twice a year, the Scots have discovered many uses for it over thousands of years, from rope making, to basket weaving, to fragrant brooms and mattresses, with the plant's sturdy stems. The flowers were used to dye fabric, provide aromatherapy, cure illnesses, and make ale. In fact, the Scottish heather ale is nothing short of legendary. Believed to have been invented by the ancient Picts, a now extinct Celtic tribe who predated the Gaelic people in Scotland, the heather ale is considered the oldest in the world. Because the ale was so prized among the Picts, its recipe was guarded carefully, only the king knew it and would pass it on to his eldest-born son. According to legend, one Pictish king sacrificed the life of his own son in order to protect the secret ingredients from the Vikings. Robert Louis Stevenson wrote a poem commemorating the event, which in part reads, From the bonny bells of heather, slash they brewed a drink langsine, slash was sweeter far than honey, slash was stronger far than wine. Another Celtic legend explains the existence of the white heather. A beautiful Celtic woman named Maldina was betrothed to the legendary Celtic warrior Oscar, but before they could swap, Idos Oscar was tragically killed in battle. A messenger was sent to Maldina to bear the bad news, but also to give her a bouquet of purple heather, sent from Oscar before he died as a symbol of his eternal love. As Malvina's tears dropped onto the flowers, the petals changed from purple to white. In her deepest pain, Malvina cried out, Although it is the symbol of my sorrow, may the white heather bring good fortune to all who find it. This is how the white heather has come to symbolize good luck and protection. What the four-leaf clover is to the Irish, the white heather is to the Scots. So even though heather is technically an English word, we really see it as a Scottish symbol. As a female given name, Heather came into popularity in the late 19th century when naming baby girls after flowers, trees, and plants became fashionable. Personality of the girl named Heather The number 11 is a master number and embodies heightened traits of the two. This personality is on a life journey to find spiritual truth. They are extremely idealistic and intuitive. Elevens have a rare and exceptional spiritual energy that brings a sense of obligation to illuminate the world around them. It's a very powerful responsibility, but these people have far more potential than they know. It's important that they surrender to higher ideals. They have the capacity to see the bigger picture, and they possess the skills to inspire others spiritually. Elevens have strong diplomatic skills and can become great peacemakers. Master numbers can be both a blessing and a curse as they walk the fine line between greatness and the potential for self-destruction. Popularity of the girl named Heather In the United States, Heather really became a decade-defining name in the 1970s and 80s. But before we get to that, let's back up a bit. The name first appeared on the American female naming charts in 1935 and grew slowly and steadily in usage for about 30 years when she finally landed a coveted spot on the top 100 list in 1967. Not content to stop there, Heather soared into the top 10 by 1972. In 1975, Heather was the third most commonly used girl's name in the nation, beaten only by Jennifer and Amy. To put this in perspective, almost 25,000 baby girls were given the name Heather in 1975, fast forward to 2011, under 400 babies received the moniker. Needless to say, Heather has lost nearly all of her fashionable value in terms of today's naming styles. 
Still, Heather was the Emma of her day just like in 30 years from now Emma will be yesterday's news. Regardless, after researching the abundant supply and symbolic importance of the Heather plant in Scotland, we have found a new appreciation for this name, and we hope more future parents rediscover this pretty now neglected name. Quick Facts on Heather Gender, Girl Origin, English Number of Syllables, 2 Ranking Popularity, 837 Pronunciation, H-E-H-T-H-R Simple meaning, heather, flowering plant. Characteristics of heather. Highly intuitive, uplifting, truth seeker, extremely bright, spiritual teacher, inspirational. Cultural references to the baby name, heather. Popular songs on heather. Heather Honey, a song by Real Mackenzies, Michael and Heather at the baggage claim, Over the Moor and Among the Heather, a song by By Fountains of Wayne, Heather Bells, Heather, Michael and Heather at the baggage claim, Heather Angel, Purple Heather, a song by Billy Cobham, a song by Tommy Rowe, a song by Guided by Voices, Bull in the Heather, a song by Rod Stewart, a song by Seven Nations, a song by Fountains of Wayne, Chasing Heather Crazy, a song by Sonic Youth. Famous people named Heather. Heather Headley, singer, Heather Graham, actress, Heather Thompson, reality TV, Heather Tom, actress, Heather Marks, model, Heather Morris, actress, Heather Langenkamp, actress, Heather Watson, tennis player, Heather O'Rourke, actress, Heather Nova, singer-songwriter, Heather Mills, ex-wife of Paul McCartney, Heather Matarazzo, actress, Heather Locklear, actress.